All right, guys. Over here on Second Road in Jomtien. And we're gonna check out what Second Road's got to offer. And uh, we're right here next to the beach, which is right there in front. There it is, the beach. And we're going up Second Road. And there's a little surprise at the end of the road in which I'm going to take you to that little surprise right about now. So let's go. So there's a little bit of shops up here. So the first couple of soys here in, uh, here in Jomtien really aren't much to look at. They're just a couple bars, small bars, small massage shops, laundry shop too, right? Yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a laundry shop up here and, and uh, just massage shops. Yeah, yeah, here, let's go this. Here, hold that. There we go, and then let me have that back. Here we go, kitty, can we have that? You already gonna hold that? All right. So you can see you can walk up and down. So again, beach roads down there, they got these little alleys, but they're full of like restaurants, small little restaurants. Yeah, we we haven't walked up here, but we've definitely driven the scooter. Yeah, and there's little little markets. Yeah, yeah. So what on that last video we talked about is it too late, too early for retirement? A little bit of budget, you know. So let's just talk about one other important thing: your first trip here. Where do you know what's stopping you? Maybe it's money. Maybe it's you gotta tell the kids, you know, whatever it might be. What's the reason you're saying no for just coming up here? So I say, guys, before you make any decision of retiring and moving money, or maybe you don't have any money, I encourage you guys, book a trip. Come here two weeks even. Of course, I'm gonna encourage you to come here more like three or four weeks, but come two weeks. You gotta come up here and check it out before you can make that decision. All right, so these are some of those really off the beaten path bars we're at. And we're only gonna walk up a little bit because there's not a whole bunch to look at. Huge pool tables, look at the pool tables. Yeah, these are the old buildings. So a lot of the people live here. And there's, not, there's nothing else up here, Kitty. Just a couple of motorcycle shops and that's about it. You want to take a photo? Yep. Okay, I got, I'm gonna keep walking. We can come back and do a photo if that's okay. You're gonna do it real quick? All right, so she's gonna take a photo of the old buildings. Mm -hmm. You never know what people wanna take photos of. Usually they're selfies if you're with a Thai person. They want selfies. So again, this is Second Road. And you saw the little sign that said Second Road. And we're gonna take an alleyway and get over the third road and we'll have our secret surprise on one of these roads coming up here. So we are gonna do that secret surprise. And uh, happy hour, four to six. 55 baht for a beer. Wow, that's cheap. So that's SMB, SMB? That's cheap. Yeah, SMB, bar. All right, super cheap, guys. So, how much was that? 50? Yeah, we're going back right now. So, here we go. So, now we went from, that was second road, right, Kitty? Soy 2. So this is Soy 3. And you'll see Soy 3, the same thing. The big difference is they have the Seahorse Lounge right here. This is it, guys. Top rated gents club right here. So, well, this would be soy three, right? I don't know yet, maybe. And then we're gonna go soy four. So let's go down soy three real quick. Let's do it. And again, there isn't much on these soys, like laundry shops, uh, sleep shop, sleep, you know, this is a sleep owl. So very inexpensive uh, hotel right there. And we're facing the beach now. So you can get room for rents, haircuts. Yeah, that's a brand new one. The Sleep Owl is actually brand new, Kitty. Here we go. 
You got this? Yep. So yeah, guys, what's stopping you? So let's talk about budget to get here. So I'm gonna take it from LAX to Bangkok. So when flying out of LAX, that's Los Angeles, California, it's gonna cost you about a thousand bucks round trip. That's with everything, including insurance on your flight. If you're spending more than a thousand dollars, keep shopping. You should be right at a thousand or less. I've seen that flight ticket for lower than seven hundred dollars. Now the, those dates didn't fit mine, so the cheapest I spent on my ticket was seven hundred and eighty-five dollars round trip. Three week, three weeks. You can do it, okay? How much does it cost to visit here, stay here? We'll just go up down this alley. I love alleys. We love alleys. I do, I love alleys. Walk it, I know, but it's the construction, it's the way people are living. There's kids. Yeah, I don't walk. Well, no, it's safe here. We'll talk about that next video, how safe it is. So, and we're just gonna walk up and down. Now we're on second. Is this, no, that was two, three, this is four. So we four. And we'll go like this, kitty. So again, these little soys off the beach road, restaurants everywhere. You will always find a place, you find laundry, 40 baht. What was that? Yeah, 40 baht though for beer. Oh, for, uh, for uh, laundry, not for beer. 55 for beer is the cheapest I've seen it. Well, a lot of people might want a beer. But yeah, this is actually pretty cool. I haven't been down this soy before. Ah, beef stroganoff, 240 baht with German schnitzel. What? That's a good price. 240 baht. Good price. What we got here? Monthly rental right here. So let's see. Continental breakfast, 150 baht, free Wi-Fi. So monthly rental. Okay. Okay. I think we should. Uh, let's go to this corner, this thing right here, and we'll turn back around. How about that, Kitty? You know, that's a that's a where some people live. So yeah, getting here, not a problem. Got to have a valid passport with six months left. That's what they want you to have. Just have a valid passport. Book your ticket. Book it for a couple weeks. When you get here, you get a 60-day stamp. You can stay 60 days. You need to have a return flight. That's the other thing. When you book your trip, have a return flight. All right, we're going to walk this way, Kitty. Have a return flight. Don't go booking one-way ticket thinking, I'll see if I like it. Now book a return flight. And if you're not sure, book a, a flexible ticket. It will cost you more. You know, and then uh, if you can get a two-week stay, how much is about a, a hotel? Is what, 40 bucks a night for a nice one? Find them as low as $15 a night. I don't advise your first night at $15 a night. Yeah, take a look at that guy. So you never know what you might find. Pinocchio? No. Pinocchio. You never know what you might find. Woo. And you gotta watch out when you're walking. So what soy is this number again, Kitty? Is this number four? All right, let's get to that sign. So we'll get walking. We'll walk a little bit of pace. But anyways, you guys are seeing what the soys look like. We're here in Jomtien Beach. Soy four. And they all kind of mix together. Two, three, four. You got little alleyways to each other with at the end of soy three, the seahorse, uh, gents club. Uh, it's a top rated gents club. And uh, that's from patiamonger.com. Rents it as one of the top gents clubs. So if you're into that, anyways, guys, thousand bucks to fly here, 40 bucks a night. 
and uh, you guys can make it happen. I would say do it. I'm trying to find the sign where, yeah, Soy 4, there we are at. Right there, fellas. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching. Hit the like, hit the subscribe. You yep. like this type of content, be sure to leave a comment. All right, Kitty. <laughs> thank you for watching, guys. Hope you enjoy. Dom Tian Soy. See you next video, next side. Bye bye, Kai.